A big jump in COVID-19 cases over the weekend. Now five more cases of remdesivir are being sent to West Texas. The antiviral medication is shown to speed up recovery, but with a limited supply, not everyone can get the treatment. Dana Morris tells you how one hospital decides who gets the drug. Well, here at ORMC, this antiviral drug is being used to treat a particular type of patient in hopes of maximizing this drug's benefit. Here's what we know. Inside each of the cases of remdesivir that are sent to our local hospitals, there are 40 doses of medication. And ORMC's chief medical officer, Dr. Rohit Saravanan, says those doses are one of the best options for treatment that COVID-19 patients have right now. We've had uh, good success uh, with patients using remdesivir. According to Saravanan, a typical treatment for a patient consists of five doses, meaning eight patients can get a full treatment off of one case. So it breaks down the virus, helps your body better fight the virus. As for who receives this treatment, Sarah Vannon says there is a protocol in place. It's meant for people that are going through a lot of complications. And Sarah Vannon says because supplies have been limited, it's important to use the drugs on patients who are the most likely to see a positive result from the treatment. It's not for those people that have gone far too much into the uh, disease process, but there that are sort of middle of the disease process that could use the extra support. But while the Texas government is sending more supplies soon to our local hospitals, there may be new sources of the medication available soon. Before, the only distribution of remdesivir came directly as an allocation from the state, but now there are manufacturers that are going to be able to make remdesivir, so we might be able to buy some. And again, according to the governor, five cases of that medication are headed here to West Texas. That's three for Ector County and two for Midland County. But as for how those three cases in Ector County will be divvied up between the two hospitals, well, that remains to be seen. For now, reporting in Odessa, Dana Morris, News West 9. The doctor also tells us remdesivir is covered by insurance companies, so the price for the treatment varies based on your coverage.